Did you ever wonder why state gardens or public gardens look just fantastic and you wonder why can't your garden look that great? I don't think it's the flowers or whatever's growing inside. I bet your garden is equally as beautiful. I think the difference is the actual edge and transition from the garden to the driveway or lawn or pathway. What you want is a nice clean definition between the garden and whatever is on the other side. The place I like to start is probably the easiest installation style of edging and I call it lay down. Um, we have three different types here. We'll start with the cobblestone landscape edging. Pretty hefty. This is made out of recycled rubber and it looks like cobblestone, so it's decorative as well as functional. The next style lay down edging is the recycled rubber edging. And this comes with landscape fabric that goes on the bottom, goes in between the um, lawn or garden and your edging, which will be on top. And it helps prevent weeds from coming through. One thing to note is this is permeable, so your rain is going to go through. Another nice thing to note is that you can run a lawnmower over it. The last type of uh, no dig or lay down edging I'll be talking about is our Easy Flex no dig edging. And this, this is nice because it gives you the look of that clean, crisp landscape edging look. So it is one coil, which you can cut, you can saw actually to cut. Um, as you can see, it's very flexible, so it goes around curves. And you put these landscape nails anywhere you need to, to help you maintain that curve when you install it. And you put it right up on the edge of your garden and you just push your mulch right up to the edge of it. So we go from lay down edging to the next step, I think, in ease of installation, and that's pound in edging. It's really versatile, made of high impact plastic, comes in sections about, about six inches across and three different heights. I'm showing you the 12 inch height right here. Nice thing about 12 inch height is you can do something like that showing up, or if you want something really high getting definition, you can choose to do that. Um, so easy to install too. You basically just pound this right into the ground. And adding to the many features of this pound and edging is the fact, um, especially on the 12 inch, if you have any invasives on the other side of the edging, not in your gorgeous flower garden, um, you can help keep them out by pounding this way down. So your edging goes way down into the ground and helps prevent roots from coming up um, and moving into your flower bed. Next up from that is our Edgar edging. And this is a pound in, comes in um, these sections. And again, um, one section just pounds in right over the other one. Very flexible, and it's got a nice little decorative sort of scalloped top to it. So you get a little more decorative, straight functional pound in edging. So let's talk about the unbreakable landscape edging. This is edging product that I'm really loving this year. And uh, part of it is it's got a great recycling story. Edging is made from 100% recycled polyethylene. And it's made to um, be sustainable through freezing cold weather to heat and can take high impact. So it's a great edging to put um, between your driveway and your lawn. So you've got almost 20 feet of edging. It can be sawn to size and it can be connected with just this little connection. So this is probably the most durable edging product that we offer. Again, it offers a, a crisp, nice crisp line between your garden or your lawn and your driveway or path. Other ways you can get that real estate look and nice crisp line between your garden and the lawn or the path is um, this Easy Flex Aluminum Edging. This is approximately 24 feet worth of edging, comes in four sections, and as the name implies, it's very, very flexible. Aluminum lasts a good long time, and the idea is to um, pound it 
and if it's about four inches high, pound it into about an inch, leaving an inch above your um, soil line. Um, so you can run your mulch right up to that edge. After the aluminum, we go right into um, an area that's becoming quite fashionable these days, and that's core 10 steel. And um, I'm showing you a before and after. Um, what you would receive from us is something that looks like this. And what it changes into is something that looks like this. And the rust does not degrade the integrity of the steel. Um, it's just, uh, it's an attribute. And they just um, slip into one another, slip in together like that, and you keep running it. As you can see, it's very flexible. So it goes around curves nicely. So we've just covered a small selection of what we offer on our website. I truly do hope it helps you make a decision uh, regarding what to choose, what kind of installation you want, what kind of look you want, and, um, and you will be so happy with the results. It will make a world of difference.